Good morning everyone, welcome back to my vlog channel. So today is actually Tuesday. Yes. I'm gonna say Thursday then, I don't know why. Today we're up bright and early, I said bright and early. It's now one o'clock in the afternoon, but we're up and we're heading to the cinema. We're gonna watch A Star Is Born, finally. We've been wanting to see this film literally since two days before it came out when we were trying to go and book and watch it, and it weren't even out yet. We're finally getting around to gonna see it, so we're gonna go and watch A Star Is Born this morning, and then Hazard's got work. I have a meeting, and Freya is just living her best life. I also forgot to mention the other day me and Freya went to a screening for Bohemian Rhapsody. It was such a good film, I'm not going to go into it too much, but I did film some stuff there so I will insert the footage now while we're in the cinema and then I guess I'll just chat to you afterwards. In fact I'm going to show you my ticket and stuff so never mind, once I've showed you my ticket there's going to be some footage of us at the cinema last time. Love that. Did you enjoy the screening we went to the other day? So fucking good. <laughs> One of the best films I've seen this year, hands down. Amazing. Hi. Cheers to this. I can't drink with it on my mouth. Oh my god, this is actually... Mine's gonna fully rip before I make one. Hi everyone, so I'm here. You're so annoying. <laughs> There's some water, complimentary. You're annoying. <laughs> You know Christmas is coming when Westfields whip out the anal beads. What a pretty view! So I'm gonna play a game of how long it takes me to fall asleep during this film. So, okay. Yeah, because me and Freya slept in, me and Freya had a little sleepover last night and I kept waking up like every hour. So yeah, I'm, me too. I'm gonna end up falling asleep during this anal. No, honestly, I, I feel like I had like four solid hours of sleep. We did an all nighter, guys. Retweet if you agree. I never let you go. Yeah. I can take your place to do it, never been before. Alright, so my plan is to um, film the entire thing and just time lapse it. I'm sure it'll be fine if I just mute the audio and speed it up a little bit. Pussy, pussy, think. pussy, marijuana. Saucy says we have an issue. Basically, I've got a meeting at four and the showing that we went to see is like a VIP thing and it's already been on at like 20 minutes now already. But it's also £18 for a ticket, so that we're not paying that. And then the next showing, which is in 20 minutes, finishes at 11 minutes past four and I've got to be in Leicester Square for a meeting at four o'clock. So we're currently just um, deciding what we're gonna do. I've seen Smallfoot. I've seen it. You've seen it? Yeah. You I watched it with my dad. Um, so I don't really know what the situation is. We're probably just gonna get food. Smallfoot. But... We're Smallfoot. Yeah. Whilst those guys are uh, looking for films, I'm gonna show you this because I think it's really cool. If any of you have actually seen Bohemian Raps today, but these are the outfits from the film. I don't think they are the exact outfits because that belt literally looks like it were one pounds to make. Um, so I think they made better costumes than this, but I just think these are like dupe costumes sort of thing. What are we doing then, sisters? Um, food. Byron Burger? Food. No, I'm having I already have two slices. We'll be Ask back shortly. Alright, right, so we've come to GBK now for some lunch. We've not been here in the longest time. The last time we came here, yeah, we came here with Josh and everyone. All I want in life is a burger right now. Like, we're not going to the cinema anymore. Because we don't have time, so when are we going to go to the cinema, actually? Like, we're going to go tomorrow. We did this yesterday and then you know you to leave. Right, even if we were on time, right? We if were, we were on time, we still would not have gone to see yeah, the film because we were 18 pounds. How did, it didn't say anywhere It never does. It, it's happened to us a few times, but it never does. Anyway, drama over. We're in at GBK and we're going to get some food. I'm literally just going to get a classic burger with some fries, as I always do. I'm so excited to eat. I've not had breakfast yet because me and Freya decided to stay in bed all morning. I love that. Piccadilly Circus now. I've left Hass and Freya in Westfields. I'm trying to find the offices where I'm going for this meeting, but I have no idea where it is. I also kind of need a drink, so I don't know what the hell I'm going to do. I might nip into Whole Foods actually. Right, I'm going to get a drink from Whole Foods. Be all right, I'm kind of lost. Right, so what I was saying is I'm now in Leicester Square. I went to go and get a drink from Whole Foods, but literally the queue is so long, so I don't have time. I'm trying to find where this meeting is, but I have no idea where it is. Got it from Google Maps, but I'm shit at following maps. I've walked in literally a massive circle. And my maps is not. Oh, I'm stressed it's not there. Oh, I can't do that, I don't understand how people do it. Like that cute little 
Why is that cute? Hi everyone, so I'm back home now. The last clip you will have seen was of Leicester Square when the sun was setting. It looked really pretty. I got out of the meeting, it all went well and lovely and some good things are happening. Hopefully, fingers crossed. I'm now back home as you can see. I tried to go into Westfield and sort my laptop out because basically, for the new work that I'm going to be doing, I need a new laptop because mine's broke. So like, hmm, I've had it since 2012 and it's now 2018. So like, I've had it like six years. So I really do need a new one. I've been trying to get a new one for like the past week now, but Apple are just shit and they keep telling me different things each time. On a lighter note, me and Freya are in on a zone because Hazard's at work. We're gonna try and turn the heating on. In fact, no, I know how to work the heating. I'm the only one in this entire house that knows how to turn the heating on. So I'm gonna enlighten Freya and teach her. She already knows how to do it. Yeah, I've been this whole time. <laughs> so why did you not, so why, every single time anyone wants the heating on, it's like, why didn't turn the heating on because we don't know how to do it. Now you've got no excuse. No, I just I walked into a wall. <laughs> Byron, please go to the door. No! Please go to the door. Freya, I don't want to mess around going to the Byron, door. Please no. Go to the door. Please. I'm being deadly serious. I'm not going to the door. <laughs> Byron, please. No, he's actually here. Go. Go, Meg! Fuck! Byron, it's a joke. What? Byron! What? Say it again. I'm so fed off. Why can't these cunts just actually, you know, do a. All I'm saying is I'm going to continue watching Zoe's vlog in peace and mind my own business, you know. So I think me and Freya just time travelled back to 19 whatever, World War whatever we're at. Um, because, listen, it is fireworks but... Oh, wait, you can't even see me in this clip. Love that for me. Anyway, um, just trying to figure out where we're going. Why are they going off right there? At the entrance. No, for I think that's dangerous. I think the stadium we're gonna have a firework display for bonfire night oh my God, going and off? someone's set it alight like where, the storage where they keep them all because that's like a mass amount of fireworks what they would set off like as a display and the whole thing must have been set alight by accident so it has been a little while since I've last filmed anything me and Freya are now we're gonna meet Has from work because she's just finished we've been watching James Charles and the Dolan Twins Emma Chamberlain Zoe Lott we've been watching an abundance of people on YouTube for the past like two hours maybe. Um, we are now going to meet Has from work, but this is my outfit. We're also going to go to a shop. I don't know if we're going to go to Sainsbury's Tesco. In fact, where have we seen pumpkins? I've seen them in Sainsbury's. We're basically going to get drunk and then make pumpkins or carve pumpkins. That's the plan for the video. Anyway, this is what I wear and I've literally got a beanie on. Like the top half of me is dressed for winter. The bottom half, not so much because I'm wearing literal shorts and my Balenciaga runners. So like people are going to be like, oh, bougie bitch in the fur and the runners and then I've got shorts on and then I'm going to die of like hypothermia. But that's just life, you know, sometimes in life You've got to be crazy, you've got to be irresponsible And that is why me and Freya are going to go and get wine And carve pumpkins all night <laughs> Bonjour, baguette, wee oui, wee, oui, pumpkin, Halloween, spooky It is a little bit chilly on these <laughs> string legs of mine There's that the sister pumpkin Just get, right, we've not got much option here Here's my pumpkin, everyone Love that for us Oh, has a zero as well Success, kids! Good morning everyone, so today is actually the next day now. I didn't end the vlog yesterday or like even say what happened in the vlog. Basically we went to Sainsbury's as you saw, we got pumpkins, we carved pumpkins and had wine and stuff. This is my pumpkin, this is how it turned out as you can see. It's a little teacup because I was like, you know what, that's quite ironic. I'm going to do like a tea sipping pumpkin for all those spooky bitches on Halloween, spooky witches should I say. Today is actually Halloween, we aren't doing anything spooky or anything festive. Has is working later on. We've got to do a few things. Things. However, we've got to go to Westfields. I feel like we go to Westfields every single day, but we've got to go to Westfields. We've got to take some photos for a brand that me and Haz are working with over on Instagram. I don't know if we're allowed to say like what the brand is. Like, I don't know what the contract says, but it is super funny. And when you find out, you'll like find it funny that we're actually working with this brand. Two main reasons. One being the name of the brand. I can't really say much because that'll give it away straight away. And also two, because we literally go there all the time and we're always in there. So you'll be like, oh my 
my god, as if like you ended up doing a brand deal with them after being there that many times. But that does mean we have to go to Westfields. I'm also gonna get my laptop today. This laptop over here, I've had for literally six years now. I've had it since 2012. And I've got a job where it requires me to do a lot more editing and stuff and a lot more work on my laptop. So like, I just need my laptop to be up to scratch because this is literally my job now. Um, Announcement, hi everyone, I quit Urban Outfitters. I didn't, I weren't gonna tell my vlog, I weren't gonna mention it, I was just gonna sort of leave it because, yeah, I don't know why I weren't gonna mention it, I just felt weird being like, hi everyone, I quit my job because if I end up going back to Urban Outfitters then I'm just gonna look stupid. But I've had some opportunities come up and I was like, you know what, for once I'm actually just gonna take the opportunities and see what happens with it, so that's what I'm doing. I'm still working, I'm still got a job technically, but I can work from home or I can work from wherever I am, so it's gonna work out a lot better for me and it does mean that I can also go home over Christmas, which I am so thankful for because last year, you all know, if you watch the vlogs, I didn't get to go home until like three days before Christmas and then I had to go back down like two days after Christmas. It was just a mess and it really made me upset because I wanted to spend Christmas with my family. So that's the situation. It is the next day. I'm doing some work currently on my laptop. This is my work uniform, as you can see, very professional. Got my little drinkity drink, pink drink. Wow, I love that. And I'm gonna get on with doing my work, I guess. Wow, I love that for me. <laughs> up doing all the worky stuff that I were doing. I'm just gonna get ready to go to Westfields. I need to tidy my room. I've tidied most of it. I'm just gonna change my bed. In fact, I've tidied my room completely. I just need to hoover and um, sort my bed out, but I've tidied all this desk area. I give my little things a wipe down because it would get in dust there. There's all cobwebs up there, so I don't really know what to do about that. But yeah, this is the situation. I'm just gonna change my bed in and make my bed, and then we're all ready to rock and roll, ladies. <laughs> dressed and ready now I just had a shower as you can see I'm all dressed I've not worn skinny jeans in the longest time but I've got my new Adidas shoes on that I got the other day some skinny jeans that I've had for literal years I got a little chain attached to these as well then I've just got a black belt on from ASOS and then this in fact this outfit's quite old apart from the shoes and like the accessories well I love that for me very vintage and very quirky we're now gonna head to Westfields because like I said earlier on in this vlog um, we basically have to do some photos for a brand that's the situation we are gonna go to Westfields right now and then yeah we'll just have to see what happens sister this is the house I want to live in it is the cutest thing in the entire world yeah. thanks this is honestly like my entire dreams in one place H&M have got their own store their own homeware store it's not open yet it opens tomorrow but look how insane it is I am obsessed where's the little sign is this a joke? This is like all my dreams come true. Hola, señoritas. This has been the longest like afternoon of my entire life. We basically went out around half past three, four o'clock. I've been in Apple ever since, and it is now eight thirty-nine in the evening like is that a joke i've been in apple like three hours but i finally have my laptop like i finally done the upgrade got it sorted i just now need to back all my old laptop up and put it onto this laptop i don't even think my old laptop's gonna be able to back up first little problems and all but like when i say i were in the apple store for the longest time i mean like bitch needs a massage after that experience Oh, my hair is looking questionable. Good morning, everyone. Today is, in fact, Thursday. I am working later on this evening. In fact, I'm working pretty much all day. As I said in the vlog clips yesterday, I am no longer... Well, I am working at Urban Outfitters up until next week. Next week's my last week. Technically means I'm doing two jobs because I've got some work to do on my new job. And then also got to work at Urban Outfitters tonight. So I'm technically working two jobs and I have been for the past month. Which is why I've not been filming much or like vlogging much and doing YouTube much in general. It's annoying though because the editing that I've got to do, I can't do on my new laptop. I have to do it on my old one because I've ordered some stuff off Amazon for like, this laptop basically has no like side piece. Like see the two little holes there? That's the only one it has. And obviously my hard drive and stuff and my SD card doesn't fit into this laptop. I've ordered like a little extender thing that you plug into the side and then you can plug USBs in like 
all sorts of different things. You can't even plug headphones into this laptop without this little thing. So I've ordered that on Amazon last night. It should be arriving today. So I can't edit this video on my new laptop. So I'm gonna have to like grill through and do it on my old laptop. So it's gonna take me so much longer than it would do if I could just do it on here. Signed up to Amazon Prime yesterday just to order the um, things on Amazon. I'm gonna cancel it as soon as they've arrived because I don't wanna pay for it. So I'm just doing a free trial at the minute. But the old Willy Wonka or Charlie and the Chocolate Factory is actually on Amazon Prime. So I think I'm gonna watch that after I finish editing if I have time that is because I don't know how long this is gonna take. But look, this is the old, old Willy Wonka. It's not even called Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. It's literally called Willy Wonka and it's on here. I remember watching it as a kid and loving it and then obviously they did the newer one and obviously this one sort of got discarded a little bit. Watch Matilda the other day. Amazon Prime actually has some banging things on there. So Amazon Prime, if you want to sponsor me, I will gladly talk about this all day long because there's actually some really cool films on here. Oh my god, Cat in the Hat, love that. Anyway, not to give Amazon more promo, I'm going to put this in my watch later list and I am going to watch that later on. It's always so bright in this kitchen in the morning. What the hell? This might be the last, this is going to be the last of the Lucky Charms. That makes me sad. That's it. The last part of LA that lived on with me. It's now gone. Thank you. Oh. What? Where were my Amazon?